Hello? Hey, man. How are you? Long time no see, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> yeah, man. <sighs> what I, how I've been, and honestly, you know, ever since it happened, it's definitely put me down on a downward spiral and just made me feel every negative emotion you can possibly think of. And, you know, I needed to do that. I needed to grieve. I needed to feel that way. And it's different for everyone. But honestly, a lot of things have been looking up for me. You know, it, it's been it's, it's it's been hard. But, you know, baby steps. We're getting there. We're feeling better. We're trying to do better things. Think in a different perspective. And it's, it's kind of been working. I mean, I did try to attempt to vlog, like, on certain occasions. But that became an on and off type of deal. And ended up not really happening but you know it, it happens but honestly when it comes down to youtube and all the projects that i do i just want to be really proud of it and just to know that I, I don't have to be ashamed for what i put on this channel and just to be me you know to be on it and i feel like a lot of our friends you know helped me establish that this summer and i'm also working on like a bunch of like secret projects and things that i that i wish to share with you in the future and i, I hope you'll be super interested in it and just you know, happy to see, like, the creative works that I get to do, and, you know, it's, it's really exciting, I've listened to, like, new awesome music recently, like, Logic, dude, I can't believe I slept on Logic for that long, and if you've been sleeping on him too, you should definitely listen to him, it's, it's amazing, he's amazing, but of course, having a universal pass definitely is worth it, I hope one day I can show you, and just for you to experience how it is, because it's so amazing, I mean, you know, time flies when you're a wizard in a mobile world, right, it's amazing, dude, and I cherish every single moment of it, but of course, I try to go to some events now and again, I had an awesome opportunity to go to a book launch, and that book launch was for the new Harry Potter book, I waited for five hours to get that book dude it was amazing i'm still really thankful to have that type of experience and that was really fun and i hope to do something like that again one day um but that was really fucking dope and um really i've just been trying to spend time with people that make me happy and look and have a positive outlook on a lot of things that i do and now you're probably wondering like oh so have you been to la hitting up all the local spots that we used to go to blah blah, blah. but to be straight up honest with you no i haven't i haven't had the opportunity to go out to the city as much as i would like to i think it's the longest i've ever been you know gone from the city for so long but from the moments that i have been there this summer i've cherished it so much because honestly Going back to the city after what has happened definitely like inspired me and just refilled my faith and hope in, in myself of being a creative person and knowing that LA has so much to offer for me. But aside from the city leaving all that stress away, I did take a weekend trip to Paso Robles recently and it was beautiful. I swam, I just had a really great time in nature and just have a whole new perspective on how I just live and how I breathe and just all these things but honestly ever since it happened i feel like the the sad or negative times are over and it's really time for me to accept the fact that you know i need to be strong for her and i feel like this you know what has happened you know shouldn't you know break me down and i feel like you know it's okay to have your off days and to feel sad and feel miserable and, and you know, feel all these things. But honestly, I And know. I know from what happened with her, she wouldn't have wanted this, you know. I, I know I need to take from this experience is that you only live once. That sounds like a broken ass motherfucking record, but it's fucking true. You only live once, you cherish it so much, and I just seek happiness and so much more positivity within life. It gets crazy. And I know that's what she would have wanted from me. I know that this is something I, I definitely need to cherish and just understand that I am a very, very fortunate and blessed person to be in this situation, to do what I do. And, you know, that's that. I have so much good things to look forward to. I'm going to a concert. I'm chopping off my hair. I have thoughts of getting tattoos. It's crazy. I've been adventurous. And it's so fucking awesome. It's going to be so fucking lit, Aria. You don't even know. 
I'm really, really excited to catch you up on it. It's going to be so fucking lit. For the long